All right, hey guys, uh, back for another video. Uh, today's video is the 7 to 13 Silverado, and we're gonna be talking about the Nissan Titan window it has, uh, pros, cons, tips, tricks, and everything in between. Uh, first, we're gonna start off by saying this is what it's gonna look like uh, raw, kind of naked. This is the, the skeleton of the window. Uh, here's a top in the scene seams uh, very easy very simple you just have your nissan titan bracket your oem from a nissan titan with your nissan titan window switch and regulator and all that with the window uh, it goes in with these nice silicone gaskets it fits flush for the most part on the entire 7 to 13 silverado except for these top corners it looks a little it's questionable but for the most part, it looks pretty good and you can't really tell. You are gonna have to cut a decent amount of the cab. So keep this in mind. Uh, you know, it makes it for a very thin layer of metal. So sound and other noises, you know, easily travel through that into the cab and vice versa. So you're gonna have to cut a little, you're gonna have to get rid of some, some carpet deadening and some foam. Uh, these vents will be exposed, which will let a lot of sound pollution inside. So these are all things to consider. Uh, one remedy I have for this would be to add sound detonator. This is Kilomat. I've seen a lot of good reviews on it on Amazon. Just one box was about $20, but it came with tons and tons and tons of sound detonator. So I think it'll be plenty. I want to does come time to putting the sound detonator on it comes in a giant sheet like this i would advise cutting it into smaller portions first vertically down the middle and then into three little subsections just so everything's a lot smaller a lot more precise because if you were to put it on like this uh, you'd be facing with like it'd be crooked it'd wrinkle it wouldn't go on straight uh, this is the first remedy i have i'm a test it out see what see how it goes the, the window is fully functioning i did not get the window switch the window button from the nissan titan i have an aftermarket button uh, i put it right here where the where the sunroof would go uh, right here in the middle uh looks pretty oem looks pretty good i can press it to go down press it to go up let's see how it looks in action this is your window, it's going down. I don't roll it down all the way because I have a sticker and I don't want the sticker to get, uh, you know, ripped off or anything, but it works perfectly fine. Goes down pretty fast, goes up. And you can see right there, the little, puck, the little pocket they cut for the window to actually slide into. So this little section right here of the brown orange is the only part of the cab you'll need to cut. Overall, it functions great. So 10 out of 10 when it comes to functionality. Uh, looks, it looks pretty good. You know, you, you see more silicone gasket on the edges. As you get closer, you can see all the imperfections, but from far away, it looks perfect in OEM. So appearance on the outside, nine out of 10. Uh, appearance on the inside though, I'd give it like a six out of 10 barely above like that half and half like it's it's passable plus you'll see your seats will be right here so you won't be able to see all this all these goodies and whatnot but to fit the titan window you have to remove tons of insulation and protection so it, it will be kind of messy if somebody looks back there and tons of sound will intrude into the cab so these are all things just to consider be sure to look out on the on this channel for a part two once the sound detonator's on. I'll give it a review, uh, pros and cons of what I liked, what I didn't like, and other options we can do. But yeah, this is your Nissan Titan window on a 7 to 13 Silverado. It should fit the same to from all Silverados across 9906. from all years, 9906, 14, 18, 19 plus. 
and the Titan window in question, it can come from any generation Nissan, uh, Nissan Titan. There's only two generation Nissan Titans and it can come from either one. And that's everything. Uh, thanks for watching and have a good day.